A sustainable and healthy food supply is always a problem. Hundreds of millions of people still suffer from hunger on a regular basis. Microbial and fungal pathogens cause a great deal of damage to plants, leading to millions in crop losses and food shortages. Biodiversity losses, soil deterioration, and the development of resistant and pathogens is leading to non-negligible problems down the road. All these aspects are calling for a different, better solution. In context of these modern issues, using precise genome editing techniques to create resistant crops would be the technically most elegant solution. Yet there remains a mistrust towards the use of GMOs, despite recent breakthroughs and an ever-improving understanding of genome editing. This mistrust was reflected in the rejection of a recent initiative in Switzerland, which aimed to ban the use of synthetic pesticides within the next 10 years. We at ITMU Zurich came up with a solution that maximizes efficiency within boundaries set by social perceptions and scientific know-how. Let me show you how. Our idea is to boost the plant's immunity proactively and hence tackle the problem at its roots. For that, we'll use outer membrane vesicles, buddings of the bacterial membrane that are produced naturally by the bacteria and have the capability of inducing the plant's immune response when sensed. In addition, the modular nature of our design will allow for the need of flexibility when dealing with the ever-changing nature of pathogens. Our project envisions a new way of how we can protect plants, support biodiversity, and retain soil quality all while edging closer and closer towards a sustainable future in agriculture.